Ooh. My Kat Von D love it. Okay. I think I like this. Is it? <laughs> I look weird too. Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. If this is your first time stopping by. Hello, welcome to my channel. I'm Zayn out Journey, and today, as you can see from the title of this video, I'm going to be showing you. Sorry, I'm going to try to recreate in Dash's summer signature summer makeup look. So, let's see how it goes. Like this video. Make sure to give the video a big fat thumbs up. A thick thumbs up so that youtube will know that you enjoyed this video and they can you know push your girl's video out okay <laughs> so without further ado let's get right into this valencia and i'm gonna be mixing that in with inar's super radiant booster and because i want it super thin almost like a tinted moisturizer consistency i'm gonna be mixing in equal parts so nothing crazy the coverage is going to be very beautiful, kind of like a tinted moisturizer, but more velvety and very glowy because we've added that super radiant booster, which is basically a highlighter that sets beautifully on the skin. And I'm going to be buffing that in very thin layers as I always do and tapping everything in and just really making it look like skin. And as you can see, it does look like skin. I'm not worried about any imperfections peeking through because I'm going to be going in with concealer to take care of applying lots of foundation on my face so i think i can kind of relate to this part god it looks so smooth i think i'll play this actually this way guys it looks so fucking cool okay and some bronze this is kind of a pre-contour with creams and i'm just doing this because you can just do creams in the summer and it looks so beautiful but of course i mean we live in dubai so i have to layer on not layer on but i have to set everything with a powder kind of because the humidity is really really high <laughs> so of course you want to go in with your preference but i love to do cream underneath and then set it with a powder i think it looks so beautiful and it makes your makeup last all day creamy concealer in the shade ginger and again i'm using this more to brighten the skin rather than really conceal so just in the areas where i want to lift the face and add more light so i'm going in underneath the eyes around the nose on the bridge and on any imperfections that she has to blend everything in i'm going in with a damp beauty blender and just tap okay i think i like this is it okay Okay, okay. <laughs> I see what you did there. I see what you did there. So let me conceal it now. I mean, I Okay, so it says it's basically just tapping and blending it. So it's kind of like the concealer move. I'm going to use that here where it has to be fast with this. It has to be fast with this. With this actually, I'm not going to lie because. Thing is, I'm not. I used to be a fan of using Beauty Blender to blend out concealer, but let. <laughs> I look weird too. Let's move to Every concealer from Nars that they're really, really oily is the soft matte concealer. I love, love that concealer. And with that one, I love using the brush. Just set everything very lightly. Tapping it in, just to lightly set everything. It's not going to give us a heavy matte look. For cream blush, I'm taking the Nars the Multiple Stick in Portofino. 
such a fresh color, it really just brings that sun-kissed glow to the cheeks. And I'm bringing it high up on Yelena because I feel like that really suits her face shape and bringing it closer into the cheeks to give her that tan, sun-kissed look. So it's a very rosy terracotta glow. Now moving on to eyes, I'm taking the NARS Pro Prime Smudge Proof Eyeshadow Base in the shade Dark, which you guys know I always, always use this, and sometimes I mix it in with the light to create a medium shade, which they do have a medium shade, but I have the light and dark because I like to mix them. And what I'm doing is I'm treating this as an eyeshadow. So I love using eyeshadow bases as eyeshadows. And going in in kind of a halo eye technique, so winging it out in the corner and then going into the inner corner and leaving the center free. Okay, so set we said we set everything with so I don't have that but I don't want to put your eyes on no more in contact. Anyways, so he setting I'm going I don't have that so I'm, I'm going to use my my carbon D lock it. Alright, I don't know why I did that, but I just feel like doing it. I'm going to set the all of my face with it. But it's nothing too crazy. Doesn't want nothing too crazy actually. So, oh, I think I see the difference. Okay. I see what you did there in that shot. I see you. Mm, 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 mm. I see that. So. Okay. Seems like it's a little bit too much. Who said? Guys, how do I look? <laughs> Hope I'm getting this thin now. Look like masquerade. <laughs> People be like, who sent who sent this? Thank you. Okay, so I think I, I look it like it though. It makes my cheeks look rosy. What do you guys think? So let's continue. I Okay, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. You already have the brows done, like, you didn't even tell us to, like, why are you doing that? Why are you doing that? So I'm going to have my brows done. Off camera. See you soon. So, got my brows done already. So, what we're going to do next is, I'm going to use a, and what you used, Looks like a burnt orange, so I'm going to use the burnt orange color that I have on my palette. That's what we're gonna work with. See in tan. For blush, of course, I'm gonna take the NARS Orgasm Blush to top off the cream blush that I did because it's gonna add even more glow to the look because Orgasm has that kind of highlighty texture to it. And it's a glam summer look. We have to go for glow on glow on glow. <laughs> so add bronzing powder. I don't have a bronzer but I'm basically using my Zara contour as well, so... So if this added contour already, I just add this, I'm going to add this bronzing powder and the contour powder basically. So... To draw line. See, I need to have a, hey guys, what should I do? I need to have summer body because I don't need to have summer body because I'm looking at my body. Eh? Hmm. This pandemic is changing me. <laughs> oh god, and I don't have any. Hmm. My summer body is zero, zero. 
So. So basically using a what's it called a blush that has sort of an highlighty stuff and perfect blush for me to use is let's go to apply it on my hair because look at this blush here it's in it's so pigmented so this blush is pigmented guys you have to be careful to keep things very glowy and fresh and this is the nars laguna afterglow lip balm i love the afterglow lip balms they feel so good on the lips and i'm just going to apply that all over and they're just super glowy and hydrating i love the red one to give you a bit of a tint if you guys like a tint and to kind of highlight the lips i'm taking the nars reef oil infused lip tint and I'm placing that on the cupid's bow and on the center of the bottom lip to give you that really plumped up look and tapping that in. It looks so, so, so. I think my camera stopped recording. So I basically used the same lip liner as my lip color and I used the same lipstick. I used the lipstick I used for my blush and I used it for my lips because it looks like the same color actually because I don't have the product it used. But I'm not sure if I like how the lips look. Tell me, tell me if you like it guys. I'm not sure I like how it looks like, maybe I should apply more. Mm. Any golden color. And I'm applying that on the bridge of the nose, on the cheekbones. Just, you know, intensifying the glow on top of the glow that I've done. And going back into my pressed powder and just tapping it very lightly on areas where I don't want it to look too oily and too glowy. So, then I'm going to go with the powder I used earlier as well. This time I'm going to use my Milani powder. See, I don't think I can. I'm going to use my Milani powder to do what you did. But if you use it in your head. So this is what it looks like. I don't know. I'm not sure of what I think about. Maybe when I when I take pictures. Uh, so thank you guys so 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 much for watching this video. Make sure to subscribe to my channel. Make sure to like this video and make sure to comment below on what you think on this look or if you're gonna try it out this summer. So thank you guys for watching my video. As you already know, peace, love, stay happy. Bye.